But with the recent opening of Nordstrom in Vancouver, we paid a visit to the Estee Lauder counter to get the secret to fabulous lips and eye makeup. Patrick, welcome to Estee Lauder at Nordstrom Pacific Center. Thank you, and I understand that today you're going to give us some tips on how to match your lip and eye color. Yeah, so this season it's great because in the past we've always done lips or eyes, and this season you can actually do both. A simple way to create a nice smoky base is to take a long wearing concealer with a long wearing eyeliner. We call this trick Simple Smoky. I'm going to start with a medium eyeshadow tone in a nice neutral color and place this starting the outside corner of the eye, sweeping in but I'm not putting any dark there in the middle of the lid. I'm gonna save that for the light color. Now to really get that smoky effect, mm -hmm. I'm gonna take our darkest eyeshadow with an angled brush. I always do two eyeliners. Why is that? I'll do a darker color on top and a lighter color underneath. What this does, it draws the attention up so the eyes always have lifted and open. We'll add a coat of mascara and the eyes are done. So what we're gonna do today is this beautiful deep purple shade. No blush for this look. We want to keep this look strong and daring. Now Derek, we're still matching the eyes and the lips here, right? Yes. But we're taking a more classic approach. We're going to be contouring the eyes today with an eye contouring kit. Okay. This is our new little black liner. It makes it so easy. When you're doing this on yourself, mm -hmm. try to hold the eye up, not out. When you hold the eye out, the liner skips. Now this is something totally different. It's actually a liquid lipstick. And I'm using one of my favorite shades for the season called Lethal Red. Now a little trick yes. to make the lips look even fuller. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna take a second color, much lighter than the first, right in the center of the lip. We call this the ombre lip. 